Hello everyone, it's a very pleasant day for football. Looking forward to this game here at the Orange Velodrome. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's France, and they take on Spain. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And superb tackle. Well, considering the form book, Stuart, Kylian Mbappe has got to be taken seriously here. Well, Derek, he's a great all-round. Oh, what an opportunity! In it goes! An early opening statement in this match. And look at the celebrations. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. So underway again here, one nil the score. Danny Olmo. Fabian. And they need to get tighter here. Fabian. Well, they would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Dembele. Options in the centre. Can they square the game? Keeper did his job to begin with. Kukureya. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Well, as you can see, France have had much less of the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really... He thwarted the attack illegally. Now, perhaps a card is forthcoming. Well, it was apparently... A... But it's a yellow card all day long. Well, the free kick... Fired too close to the goalkeeper. Fabian. Can they hit? If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. And no more time left. We've reached the halfway mark here at the Orange Velodrome. And the ball is moving again, with France looking to build on a largely positive first-half performance here. Morata. Oh, a smart stop. Favouring the short one. Morata is up there. And still dangerous. Simple catch, really. Oh, a lovely ball. Mbappe. He might yet finish. Putting his body on the line. Well, an opportunity for France to add. Short corner taken. Well, space if he goes inside. Superb block. Taking care of business defensively here. William Saliba. Jules Kunde on the ball. Kono Muani. Long way out. But he can't keep that effort on target. Kono Muani. Trying to really get at the opposition here. And a goal! Cause for celebrations again! Two in front! Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him.
2-0 now and back on the way there's 10 minutes remaining here Fabian no way through oh he's lost possession Well, the seconds are ticking away and the home side in control. Stuart, what have you made of this? Yeah, clearly the better side. Obviously being fantastic up front, but it's their work ethic for me. They're just not happy unless they have the ball and they're fighting to win it back whenever they do lose it. It's been a really great performance all round. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. again and it's all about the pace in transition they're so quick to get out from the back and it makes the striker's job so easy all he has to do is make the right connection it's a lovely goal well there it is the final whistle and France have prevailed in this one Stuart your thoughts Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserve the result in the end.